What's happening, you fine human beings, you? Wednesday morning, I had to see what day it was. We're going to stroll up here, top our fuel tanks off. I got enough to make it over to the next place. But it's a, it's a town pump. And they sell pilot fuel, but I don't. I don't want to take no chances of not not supposed to be getting fuel there. I think we probably can get fuel there. Um, they only want us getting fuel to loves. The loves are pilot and flying J. And like I said, they sell pilot fuel. It shows up on the pilot app. So I would say that'd be safe to get fuel there. But I'm just gonna go ahead and top them off here to loves. And then we're gonna stroll across the mountains there. Um, a couple mountain passes we gotta go through. Uh, try to get over there and kick this first stop off. So, boy, we hoping we can be empty by midday. We'll see what happens. So, but guys, hang around. Subscribe to the channel. Um, I'm going to try to start working on figuring out because the numbers are going up and it's everybody I've talked to on, uh, about YouTube that does YouTube they say their channel will just kind of start creeping up the subscribers and then it's like all of a sudden it takes off out of nowhere so I'm going to start trying to work on putting something together to give, give away to you guys that way when it does get there I'm not caught with my britches down so, but remember, 500 likes. If, I, if we can get 500 subscribers, then uh, we'll give something away. But guys, hang around and see if we can't get this day going.
back guys. Got the, the Hayden stop off. Hayden, Idaho. Uh, Linda. Linda says 123 miles. Lisa says 142 miles. Down to the stop down Lewiston. So I don't know. We'll figure out which one's which. Um, good ride over here. A lot of curves. There was some actual white stuff flying around a little bit. A little mixture. Uh, but it's all good. Hurry. Hopefully we can hurry. Get Lewiston off. And maybe get reloaded today. That'd be nice. We'll see what happens. That way we can head back east before it gets bad. It's supposed to. They're calling for some stuff over here, I think. So, I right, we'll see what happens. So, hang around, guys. Subscribe to the channel. Share the channel. Give me a thumbs up. I appreciate you. I'll catch you back on the next one.
All right, we're in Lewiston now. Uh, I'm waiting on the guy to come out here to take the machine off. I don't know what the travel agent's got stored just yet, um, but I'm, if it's gonna be a little bit, I'm actually probably gonna move that stuff around. I should have done it this weekend when I didn't have to fight all of it, but I was lazy. Who would have thunk it? So, but as soon as I know what's going on, um, what the plans are going to be and whatnot, I will check back in with you guys and I will let you know what you know what's going on from here. So I don't know if we'll be going to North Bend to pick up Genie lifts. Um, I don't know. I don't know. If we'll go pick up onions somewhere, who knows? Can't never tell. So, but I'll check back in with you guys here in just a little bit. I got Lewiston off. I don't really know what I'm doing yet, but I'm gonna go down the street here to this little truck stop. Hopefully I got better cell phone signal there. I ain't got nothing here. It's hard to do anything on it. I tried piddling with my headache rack. I was gonna put my tarps on top. That ain't gonna work. They're too big. I've got them rolled up a little different. I might try it, roll them the way I normally roll them. We'll see what happens. They're a little bit smaller around that way. So, I don't know, we'll see what happens there. Uh, but I'm gonna run over to this truck stop, guys. And I'll probably fix me a sandwich or something to get over there and wait on our travel agents to let us know what to do. I will check back in with you guys here a little bit. All right, real quick, guys. I'm going to just get off phone with the, uh, well, he texted me, travel agent did. And uh, I am going to head to what they're doing over here. Uh, I'm gonna head to up towards Seattle and then I probably won't load till tomorrow but I'll be up there so I think I'm gonna try to head to that T8 North Bend because if I'm getting genie lifts it's right around the corner from that T8 so we'll have a good clock to start with. So but guys stick around and I will check back in with y'all a little bit. Dope, guys I'm in Ellen oh sorry 
Ellensburg, Washington, I think it is. I'm just east of Snoqualmie here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and stop and just stay here tonight. I'm two hours from where I'm loading over. In, I'm actually loading in Kent, Washington, which is kind of south of, of Seattle there. Uh, picking up a load of granite, and it's taking it back to uh, Norcross, Georgia. Uh, supposed to be out there Tuesday, I think. Thanks what my text said. Can't remember now. Um, I, I figure I'm going with maybe the reason I didn't get the genie lifts. Most of that stuff is multiple stop loads, and they go all over. And like I said, I've got to be home the 22nd because we're taking a little, me and the wife are taking a little, I don't say a vacation, but we're taking a little getaway for our anniversary for that weekend. And I got to go vote too. Exercise your right, especially this year, go vote. And I'm going to do that when I get home. That way I ain't going to worry about going back home. Getting home on the 3rd, so I'm going to vote early. In person. So... Yeah, I'm two hours away, 110 miles from where I'm loading at. So, heavy load. Um, but, I had the, uh, he told me I could go ahead and take my 34. And, load it Friday. But, I don't want to be around here. If it, the forecast don't look too hot for this area starting this weekend and I mean that stuff I don't want people to think that I'm that I don't you know that I'm scared to drive in and stuff but if there's a chance where I can avoid it we gonna avoid it um, I like driving in it, it it's a change um, it, it changes the pace up a little bit Dangerous, yes, but at the same time, you know, it's not the same everyday thing. So, yeah, that's where I'm at on that deal. Um, I think I'm in between two dry vans here, and it's really windy, but I think I'm going to do some studying since I got plenty of time, and I might do some drone exercising. I'm going to get good at flying that thing. That way I can give you guys good content with it. Um, I was going to show you. <laughs> the truck is a disaster now. I'm not going to sleep good for a while. Until I can get it washed at the end of the week. It's, it's rough. I don't. It ain't reached the point yet. To where I want to drive with a paper bag over my head. But it's awful close. So. But. I was going to show you, but it, like I said, it's still a little windy in between these two trucks. I'm not going to do a whole lot of high flying stuff because, like I said, it's windy. And I don't want my drone to end up back over in Spokane. <laughs> so. But, guys, I appreciate y'all stopping by. Um, I don't believe I got anything else to cover. I don't think I do. No, nope, I don't. So if I get some of, if I do, if I get a little bit of stuff up, I might put it in a video. I don't know. I, that was kind of interesting. I don't know. Comment down below. I I know what deer are. I do know that. But if you, I I, I don't really know how much or how well. I'm pretty sure it was elk, but in the one clip when I was going down to Lewiston, I about didn't get get it started recording fast enough. I couldn't find my little remote. It had moved down in the seat. Um, I think it was elk. Either way, it's the first one of those I've seen. Um, I don't think they were big enough to be moose. I don't think this is a place for moose. I'm not 100% sure, though. Like I said, I know what deer are. I know what antelope are, and it wasn't none of the above. So, it was either moose or elk. I believe it was elk. 
They're pretty good size. That, that's the first time I've ever, that I can recall that I've ever seen one of those dudes in person. And I think I know what he was up to. Uh, but we won't get into that on this channel. I'm just glad he got across the road before he proceeded, so. So. Anyways, guys, comment down below what those were. <laughs> I know it sounds kind of weird, but I thought it was pretty cool. A lot of pretty country. Um, I'm trying to, still trying to figure out how to incorporate some of the driving. I really want you guys to see the driving, because that's... That's one of the beauties of this job is seeing the scenery out here, especially when you go on those back roads like that, two lane roads. Uh, but I don't want it to consume the whole video. Uh, like I said, I'm still trying to split it up. I hope I ain't looked at none of the footage yet. I hope the unloading stuff was good. Um, that angle that that light bar puts that camera at, I'm still, I'm gonna look at all the pieces I've got that puzzle and try to put it together uh, to where it's not I'm afraid it's going to be pointed down to, towards the front of the trailer too much so I guess I'll see here in a little bit whenever I go to edit and all this video together uh, I do like um, using my phone that worked out pretty good last night however the video went up a little bit later this morning uh, simply because when I was setting all that up last night I didn't set it to upload at 6.15 a.m. I set it to upload at 6.15 p.m. I forgot to change the a.m. and the p.m. So, but we got it took care of. But it was a lot easier. And I, I think the quality still turned out further. I mean, I, I was kind of worried that it might lose some of the quality. But I don't believe it did. So, but yeah. I'm going to, before it gets too dark, I'm going to do some studying real quick on flying this drone the right way I guess and see if we can't get a little maneuver done in between these two drive ins so guys I will check back in with you all uh, in the morning I guess and see if we can't go load some granite tomorrow subscribe to the channel share the channel I've not said share the channel in a while but it is growing like I said and I'm grateful for that, but it'll share, it'll, if you'll just click on share, I think you, I think you might have to go, actually go to the channel page, uh, on YouTube, and then it'll have somewhere on there, share, and you can actually just share the channel, so just share the video, so, I mean, if you're watching this video, click down on Nate Gone Trucking down here, somewhere, I don't, I guess it'll be down here, I don't know, it, it big bold letters. And click on it and it'll take you actually take you to the channel and then when you get there that's where you can share that um, it'll have share up towards the top that way you can actually share the channel so but yeah y'all are getting the word out there I'm I've not I pushed it quite a bit there at first and I didn't want to be that guy that was annoying but I wanted it to be known I was doing it so I will I might start sharing some again now that it's getting bigger and we're getting, a, I think, I think we're getting a little bit better. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting a little bit better at it, so. But yeah, I will check back on you guys tomorrow. Last mile was the hardest. Um, you keep them straight out there. <laughs>